Uh, so guys, I hope you had a great New Year Eve celebration and actually many Asian communities are waiting for another big event, especially for the Chinese around the world, um, that is Lunar New Year. And one of my resolutions this is that I want to try my best with our team to demonstrate some more interesting and expected and hopefully mind-blowing laser project. And today, I actually have a great idea. Just follow me. Let me just adjust the focus. Okay, good. Let's roll. Happy Chinese New Year, and this is Kai. I'm wearing this town suit and a dragon cutie on my head because the February 10th gonna mark the beginning of the year of dragon. And today I'm very excited to embark on this laser engraving journey, crafting this wooden dragon in stunning 3D relief. Let's bring this majestic creature to life. Okay, we're gonna use X2S1 20 watts of dial laser and a 15 millimeter thick of hardwood, not plywood. And right now, let's just place this hardwood inside. It's a tricky work to choose your materials, such as this block of hardwood. You can definitely tell the color difference between this part and the right side, okay? And we did a test before. I mean, the final result is not that bad, but you can still tell the color in this area is a little bit darker and the color on the top is a little bit lighter. So you definitely want to choose the material like this. The color is very even. And right now we're gonna place this block of hardwood into the center of your honeycomb. And move your laser module to the top left. Here's the dragon we want to relieve engraving. And you can actually use our XArt, which is our AI function to design your own Chinese New Year dragon. And to have a better relieving result, so here we want to laser engrave more than once. We're going to laser engrave twice actually. So let's just copy and paste. But in your case, you can laser engrave more than twice. There you go. And we're going to reduce the grayscale to a third okay, of the second picture. Then we can make this picture a little bit more bright. You can see the details. So the white part, actually because we already reduced the grid scale, so you can't really laser engrave this part. But the dark part, you can definitely laser engrave twice. So in the end, the whole picture will be more layering because the dark part will be darker and the whole thing will be very different from the original picture. And next, we're gonna set up the picture as a new layer. Let's choose the red color and remember to drag the red color and the red layer down there. This is the order we're gonna laser engrave. And next, we're gonna combine these two pictures together. Just click align, horizontally align center, and vertical align center. And we click group, cool. Let's drag the pattern in the middle, and make sure don't be on the gray part. So we're gonna laser engrave at 52% of power, and the speed will be 150. And we're gonna choose the bitmap mode to Atkinson because this mode has a better result. And next, we're gonna measure the distance between your hardwood and your laser module. Just click this icon. And that's it. And we're gonna start marking. We're gonna make sure the area is exactly where we wanna relieve engraving. So just start up marking. And we're gonna choose rectangle. And we're gonna move our laser module to the top left, very close to the edge. And we push the button on the machine. And we're gonna find the ending point the bottom right and push the button one more time and click end marking and it's done so let's drag the pattern to the circle that's the area we want to laser engrave and here's the tip because you want to have the whole pattern on your hardwood right so your picture should be a little bit bigger than your working area let's hit the process You want to learn how to make a New Year Eve decoration or toy for your children like this? Subscribe to our YouTube channel and turn on the notification. Wow, check out this. It takes on a spectacular result, isn't it? Look at all the detail. You can actually touch it to feel the 3D relieving result, like the teeth, the screamer is really fantastic and actually you can make it a bit darker or lighter we did another version before so you just adjust the parameter of the original picture and you're gonna have a different effect 
Alrighty, we've shared all the relief techniques for you today. And of course, this relief idea can be used for furniture decoration, such as doors and cabinets. And if you have a better relief works, please share with me on the comments. And see you next time.